Cisco Estevan Traffic Engineering route traffic on a different path from routing table without changing routing table exactly like PBR or policy based routing in traditional Cisco routers. Traffic Engineering is another data plane policy implemented in a centralized policy in VSmart controller. However, it is implemented centrally but final policy is pushed from VSmart controller to one edge routers. Otherwise, it is not possible to implement a data plane policy in VSmart controller since data traffic never goes through VSmart controller. Currently, there is a direct connection between site 2 and site 3. As an example of traffic engineering, let's change the path of traffic between these two sites in a way that it goes through hub site without manipulating any route in routing table. In other words, we will change the path of the traffic between site 2 and site 3 with changing next hub IP address but in data plane and routing table will not be changed. Before starting configuration, let's check how is the connection between site 2 and site 3 as an example. As you can see, at the moment, we have a direct connection between site 2 and site 3. We will change the path in a way that it goes through hub site. In the previous section, we implemented data plane, access lease and application firewall in a centralized policy. Since it is not possible to apply more than one data plane policy to VSmart controller, I will edit this policy also to include our new traffic engineering policy. I change the name and description from ACL from services to ACL underline ENG underline from services to show that it include both policies. If you remember, in addition to application firewall, there are some other data plane policies that can be implemented in VSmart controller. With clicking on sequence type, you can see that quality of service and traffic engineering are some of these policies. We choose traffic engineering to implement our new data plane policy. The most important point in implementing traffic engineering is to change t -lock for our target traffic. We change t -lock to hub site for any traffic between one site. Sequence for source and destination for source from 107.216 to destination 107.216 The action will be accept and TLOC and VPN for VPN 10 traffic TLOC IP must be hub location which we have configured in previous sections then we have to save and activate our policy If we check the configuration difference, it is clear that our previous VSmart data plane policies 
editor and new traffic engineering rules are added. The name has changed from VPN 10 ACL from services to ACL ENG from services. Sequence 1, sequence 11 and sequence 21 is our access and application firewall and sequence 31 is added to the same policy for source and destination. 172 16 action accept and T lock would be hub location. Hub locations mean MPLS and internet for the hub system IP. So configure devices. Just to review, remember that this policy is already applied to all spokes in direction from service VPN to one infrastructure. Edit, policy application, traffic data, ACL ENG from services. It is already applied to all spokes in VPN 10 from service VPN to one infrastructure. We can also review the configuration by clicking preview button. As you can see, sequence. This is our data plane policy, sequence one, sequence 11, and sequence 21 is for our access list and application firewall but sequence 31 is our new traffic engineering policy for the source and destination IP address 172.16 TLOC must be changed to hub location and by hub location it means system IP of site 1 once over internet and once over MPLS. Save policy change and then activate. Now we can check again the connectivity from site 2 to site 3 to see if traffic engineering works and traffic goes through hub site. As you can see, traffic goes through hub site. This is the internet connection of hub site. I check once again, this is the MPLS of hub site. Once again, this is internet in a hub site. As you can see, traffic is loaded between MPLS and internet infrastructure to hub site through the hub site traffic goes to the destination 172.16